Hey everyone, I am back with a brand new weekly vlog. It is Monday, yes, Monday, Easter Monday, bank holiday. And I have been working for most of the day. When you freelance, unfortunately, you don't get bank holidays off. Well, unless you want to get paid for it. So I chose to work for most of the day and I feel good because I've got kind of the things that I want to get done um, to start the week done. Um, and then I put away a delivery that was I was waiting for before just now. And now I'm gonna go to the gym because I feel like I haven't been in ages. I've just not really been feeling like up to exercising at the moment, which is kind of strange for me. I'm always quite, yeah, I feel really good when I exercise, but at the moment I've just been like, not been bothered because I've just been being tired and whatnot. So yeah, gonna try and go today. I'm paying a ridiculous amount of month for this gym because, um, I like it, but it is very overpriced, I will admit that. Just in my kind of cosy workout gear. I got my hair down today, um, but I'm gonna put it up, obviously. Probably gonna film a little um, current skincare routine later. I did edit a video um, yesterday, which was a kind of journaling routine that I'm doing at the moment. So I'll show you that too. I've got a fairly good week coming up. I've got a few like social things going on <laughs> with friends. So I think I'm gonna film those um, so you can see that. I don't know, I filmed my video yesterday on my 45mm lens I washed it back and I feel like my face looked huge so hopefully it's the perspective and it's just like a widescreen thing because um, yeah otherwise it's not going to the gym thing it's definitely shown on my face because um, yeah <clears throat> Let me just turn the radio down They're playing some really good songs on the radio it's like um, old school classics and they're playing the Scissor Sisters at the moment, which is um, a song I really loved in the past. It was very quiet, so that was nice. And I actually left my headphones there the last time I went. This shows you how long I haven't been. So I left them last time when I went with my friend and haven't been since. I didn't even realise I left them there. So it's a good thing I didn't pay a lot for them because um, I should look after my stuff more. We we'll vlog tomorrow because, to be honest, I'm not really doing much tonight. We're having chicken black bean um, for dinner, which will be lovely. I have a phone call with my friend as well because I haven't spoken to her in a while. So that is a plan for this evening and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning, it is Tuesday lunchtime and I have just been working this morning as per usual. Um, so now I've stopped to have some lunch and I'm having, I'm trying to stand this way so it's not too messy in the kitchen. Um, I'm having some leftovers from last night and I love having lunch at home. It's just so much easier than having to bring it in to work every day. A leftover chicken and black bean meal here, which my dad made last night some salad and some butter on a wholemeal muffin. Um, one of those bread muffins you get. Down and have this and try not to look at my laptop and phone while I'm having lunch and listen to a podcast. Um, I'm really loving podcasts at the moment just to have one in the background. I think they're just so calming and especially if you listen to the right ones. And the one I've been loving at the minute is called Awaken Radio by Connie Chapman. Um, she's an Australian woman. And they're just kind of like very self-empowering and she's just, an amazing person like I feel like I relate to her quite a lot so I think that's probably why I like them um so yeah I'll link her podcast down below so you can have a look at that this afternoon I'm going to go work across the road at the coffee shop and um my friend Vicky is also going to come and work there too and then I am going into Oxford for dinner with my two friends um Robin and Hayley who also have blogs I'll link theirs down below too so you can say hi to them we're going to Franco Manca and we're going to take some photos before so that should be really fun and I'm really excited actually because I'm going to, I got invited today to go to Victor's um, restaurant opening in Westgate, Oxford. And it looks so beautiful um, inside there and the food looks amazing. So I'll definitely be vlogging that um, later on in the month. Family are out this morning, so it's been quite nice having some peace and quiet. I know they'll appreciate me saying that, but it is what it is. I'll see you a bit later. Okay, I'm in Oxford now with Hayley and Robin and we're just taking some blog photos down the street and it's a really cute street actually. Apart from the bikes, um, it's nice and photogenic. There's a lot of coloured walls here. And they're over here taking photos, I won't film too much. Then we're going to go get pizza after. I also made a cheeky purchase in Charlotte Tilbury before I came here. I picked up the Flawless Filter which I was looking for the other day and it is the light shade I believe. So I'm really happy to have that now. And she did try a concealer on me, but um, I didn't really like it. So still looking for a good concealer. That is what's going on now. So I'm gonna go and get back to helping with the photos. 
and I'll show you the pizza when we have it in a bit. Hey. Was it recording? Yeah. This day's gym outfit of the day. Side way? No. That way. Okay. Gym outfit of the day is my bikini hoodie, my Gymshark leggings, which are a bit wet because I just had an Instagram photo. Good morning everyone, I've just filmed a video and um, so it's getting me confusing actually filming all this, all these different vlogs in one go but I've got a day off today, I'm getting my hair done I'm travelling over an hour to get it done which might be crazy for some of you but um, I really like April Scott hair and it's where I like to go to get mine done I'm really excited because I haven't had it dyed in so long and I really want to go for like a drastic change but I don't know if that will happen. My video is going to be on the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter Primer so look out for that soon. But I thought I'd quickly show you the makeup that my friend Vicky gave me the other day because um, she is a makeup artist and had a lot of things she wasn't using so she asked me what colours and brands I liked and she brought me this little package so I'm going to try and tidy up quickly before I um, show you. Oh, nearly. Um, I really need to get a new chest of drawers, just ignore the hideousness of that. Um, so first up we have this long con blusher which is in shade Rose Ballerina or Peachy Pink. How pretty is that? MAC Warm Soul Blusher, this is like the mineralized blush I think. Lovely warm shade with a bit of shimmer. Great for like a kind of subtle bronze for paler skins like me, which I was so excited about, is the Charlotte Tilbury Sophisticate palette. Now I have the Dolce Vita one, um, which I do like, but this one's more matte so I can use them like on an everyday basis. The MAC Patisserie, which is quite a well known one, um, nice pinky nude shade there. Um, this one is Bobbi Brown's Baby Pink Lipstick, quite similar to Patisserie actually, actually. Um, really like that one too. Um, this is the sheer lip colour, which is what I've got now, in Ballet Pink, also very lovely. This one is Bare Pink, really pretty nude, I've tried them already. <laughs> the Chanel one, again I never treat myself to Chanel, so this is lovely. This is Boy, which I actually think I've heard of, so maybe, oh I've heard of the Boy bag, <laughs> that's probably why. I'm really set with my nude lipsticks now. Some lovely products there, so thank you Vicky if you're watching this. And she also got me some trainers. Um, these ones, which are my favourite, I love the shape of them. They're the Nike Free ones. And then these are the Nike Free 5. Oh, this is a free and flexible um, fit. And then this is a free 5.0. Um, so yeah, loving the blue. Obviously I love blue, so that's great. So I've got quite a long drive ahead of me. I've also got some quotes to go in the um, frames of my wall, so I'm going to do that later and take everything out and put it back in and freshen up my quote wall. I've just got them on, um, I created the quotes myself on Canvas, which is like a, or Canva, which is like an online photo editing free app thing. I did that the other day and they arrived yesterday through Snapfish, so I'm going to put them in later. Blue skies, which is so rare in England. So I'm in the car ready to go. Got my dirty chai latte from the coffee shop for my journey because um, I think it's nice, my day off. I deserve a coffee. I say that, but I actually have a coffee every day, so um, I've really been enjoying listening to podcasts recently as I'm driving. So today I'm going to listen to Jess Lively's podcast, and I kind of just perch it in my this little thing here. I don't actually know what it's for. <laughs> my phone sits here, and then the speakers go on. So um, it's 43 minutes long, so the drive is a bit longer than that, but um, the rest of it I can do with. Um, Good old Radio 1 or something, other radio stations are available. Back home now, it was a long drive home, but um, definitely worth it because I'm really happy with my hair. I'm going to need to make sure I keep up with the dry, not dry shampoo, the purple shampoo, make sure 
that doesn't go brassy. But I did get a new phone case, which I want to show you quickly, from my favourite phone case company, Ideal of Sweden. And it's this pretty blue and white case. Uh, I did choose it, actually, from their collection. I just love it. I love blue and white. It's my favourite combination. So that is a new one for my phone. And it is nearly six o'clock. I'm going to have some dinner and I've pretty much got my bed ready for bed. <laughs> so what I'm going to do now is um, take my makeup off and I would like to... I need to put the quotes in my wall frames like I said earlier. Um, so I'll probably show you those tomorrow and then just edit a video. Nothing too crazy for this evening. Um, this has been a good day off. I should have days off more often but I need to earn a living so just had to show you my new quote wall. Pretty happy with it and put it together really quickly, so yeah. yeah. <laughs> Say hi for the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Dirty chai. Good afternoon, I'm on the way to a yurt because me and Vicky, who's driving, um, are going for lunch, afternoon tea, that kind of thing. And we've heard some good things about the yurt and they do like homemade food and ice cream and all sorts of things so we're going to check it out and see what it's like. Um, my hair is matching my shirt today, <laughs> nice and yellow. So yeah we're going to check it out and I'll do a bit of filming in there and see um, if it's not too busy and show you the kind of scenery. We're definitely out in the country, um, there's not any other cars <laughs> on the road. It's very scenic. Going to a yurt. <laughs> I'm the yurt, so I'm um, gonna go inside. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. For the soup and homemade bread, and Vicky has gone for what's it called? <laughs> Roasted spring veg with romesco dip. Which looks very nice. Very excited to check in. Hey! hey. <laughs> I was debating whether to give you an honest review or not. Um, we were waiting quite a while to get in and seated. Then move seats. Tried to book. Apparently, Vicky tried to book, but. Um, they said we went out to book, yeah, online. So. Yeah. But we got a seat and we chose our meals, which I showed you a bit of, which were actually really nice. Um, mine was really good, the soup and the homemade bread was amazing. And we had a wander around. There's not too much else here. So I would, I would come back maybe on a weekday when it was a bit quieter. <laughs> so I will see you guys in a bit. Just got home after the lunch at Yurt and now this afternoon I'm going to edit this weekly vlog to go up um, next Wednesday hopefully. I'm thinking maybe of doing weekly vlogs on a Wednesday and then a normal video on a Sunday, so let me know if you like that idea. We'll just try and do two videos a week. Um, we'll see how that works out. And then I will maybe start another weekly vlog tomorrow. So thank you for watching. Leave a comment if you enjoyed the vlog. Subscribe, obviously, if you want to see more videos from me. I will see you next time. Bye.